So you're probably wondering why we're here tonight. This means a lot to everyone. It's midnight. With everything that's been going on, especially the pandemic. So I did tell them to come out at midnight and I wouldn't wake them up, but I may go ahead and do that. So. Once again, for the fourth year in a row, this is the number one NICU. The first year, it was amazing. The second year, it was like, did it really happen two years in a row? The third year is like, this is real. And the fourth year is out completely off the chart. Who's luckier than us? The whole country is focused on the pandemic, but we get to come here every day and work together to be part of the solution. It is up to us to kind of give the best care that we can, especially during these times when in, both parents can't even be here uh, with their baby uh, because of the pandemic. So I think it's important for parents to know that when they can't be here, that the people here, the doctors, the nurses, everyone is there taking care of their baby. I think it's very special this year and it's the, the team has worked through it. We've had patients that have been exposed and we've had to deal with all, all of this. I think it's incredible, yeah, and I, I think it's the leadership and just every nurse on the unit. We all put a lot of our strength, our dedication to this work. I'm so very, very, very proud. There's no better feeling than when you get to send a baby home uh, with their mom and dad or with their parents. And uh, I definitely was not expecting this when, uh, when I started my shift. Congratulations to the neonatology team. We're so incredibly proud of you. The leadership here stands behind you. We support you. And wow, another year. Congratulations.